When Ross was about two and a half months old or so, he started intermittently vomiting and we went to the pediatrician and he thought of course he had a very typical virus. Ross continued to get sicker, vomiting, more lethargic. Um, I could see he was gotten very pale, he wouldn't sleep. So he was ambulanced right to the University of Iowa. He got very, very ill, had to go to the PICU. We had figured out that Ross had a very rare genetic birth defect. Cobalamin G defect is what he has, and there's less than 40 of him documented in the world. And so it's an extremely rare disease. Ross is the first here in Iowa. And that began our journey of 12 years with the University of Iowa. Ross presented when he was about two and a half months of age and he was transferred to our intensive care unit very critically ill, spent uh, two plus weeks in the intensive care unit and it was later determined that he has a rare genetic metabolic disorder that was the cause of all of those very serious problems. He has done amazingly well. They didn't know if he would survive that initial visit in the Peace ICU, but he continues to thrive and we're hopeful that that will continue and he will continue to do well. They saved his life. They, you know, they never gave up until they discovered what was wrong with him. They treat us as well as him. They understand that when you have a sick child, it affects your whole family. The genetics team is trying right now, even as we speak, to figure out what else that we can do for him. They're never giving up. There's no better place in Iowa or the Midwest, that may you all know, our belief, that you would rather be at when your child is this sick. We feel that you get the best care in Iowa City. What's the word that describes a place and people that save your child's life? I mean, there are no words for that, I and mean, it's too huge.